Good afternoon, viewers. I'm reporting live from the city centers. The condition of green space is becoming increasingly alarming as they are being replaced by concrete and tall buildings. The impact, city temperatures are rising and pollution is uncontrollable, and the carbon emission continues to surge. Green open space will show surfer as our filters are not normally extinct. If left unchecked, the city will lose the ecology balance. It's time to act before the earth totally runs off of bridge. From the problem that they said before, how about all of you guys giving any opinion? Do you guys have any opinion? We should add more trees, but as you know, we have limited space. We need something more flexible, like a liquid. Hmm, liquid tree maybe? Oh, I know! Yeah, yeah, we cool. So, let us show you the neon fluid tree. Is this a tree? No, it's more than that. Because the neon fluid tree uses chlorella vulgaris and linglorinium polyhedra, small creatures that have carbon dioxide absorption efficiency equivalent to a 20-year-old tree. Besides that, when the night comes, neon fluid tree will light up and can be used as an ecstatic street light. Why? Not only because the natural glow, neon fluid tree also equipped with infrared sensor that can detect the night. Awesome, right? But there's a twist. Neon fluid tree is also equipped with sensor that can detect weather. How does it work? When the sensor detects overheat weather, the red LED will light up. And if the sensor detects weather, then the white one will light up. Cool, isn't it?